And now, it's time for America's favorite psychopaths, Sergeant Quit Grinder's Suicide Squad. In our last installment of the recently declassified Grit Grinder files, we revealed the top secret objective of his squad to rescue the Prime Minister of Great Britain, Neville Chamberlain, from a prison deep in the dark heart of Hitler's Germany. We return you now to a training camp somewhere in America's heartland. I know it's hard to believe, but the Nazis have kidnapped Neville Chamberlain. The man running England is really a German agent, an imposter. This is why Britain's been crawling to the Germans for so long. Now, I'll give you your briefing. What's all this bullet dust about a briefing? When I was fighting in the Spanish Civil War, I showed those flamenco flouncing flunkies the difference between bullfighting and bullshitting. And I sure as hell didn't need a briefing to tell me how to do it. Well, Grit, if you'd had a briefing, you'd have known you were supposed to be fighting for the Republic, not the fascists. You do realize it matters which side you're on in a war? Of course it matters. It matters you're on the winning side. Okay, men, let's move out. Uh, General, before we go, how long do we have to complete this mission? Well, Private Green, you've got two days to fly to Germany, fight your way in, locate Chamberlain, fight your way out, then fly to England. It's a tight schedule, but if you don't stop to urinate, defecate, or fornicate, you should just about make it. Right, men, let's move out. Uh, but General... Green... Yes, Private Green? Uh, what's the reason for the time limit, sir? That's because in two days, the fake Chamberlain will announce that Britain is surrendering rather than declaring war. And that leaves us no chance of getting into it. There'll be no honor, no glory, and no fourth star on my lapel. If you think I'm going to wait another ten years for that, you deserve to be in Sergeant Grinder's squad. Right, men. Let's move out before there are any more stupid questions. But where exactly is Mr. Chamberlain being held? Look, Meadows, you pacifist pansy. Are you going on the mission or on a scenic tour of Germany? What we'll do is start at the Rhine and fight our way east till we run out of Germans. With luck, we'll find this chamber pot somewhere along the way. Actually, Grit, I think it might be a bit faster if you started in Munich. That's where we've arranged a rendezvous with a special agent in our employ who'll give you further information. He's the one who knows where Mr. Chamberlain's being held. Right, men, let's move out. his own dead body. So I blew the whole lot of them up. <laughs> oh, oh, gee, that's a, that's a real funny one, Sarge. C can we stop marching now? We're wearing a hole in the fuselage. Luck, soldier. Just keep marching and leaning forward. I want to get to the killing as fast as I can. Sarge, how can you possibly like war? Aren't you sickened by the suffering? The brutality and the senseless waste of human life. No, not a hell of a lot. Oh my god! The Sarge just shot Meadows! Let that be a lesson to you, men! What? In, in how there's no place in a commando unit for a lily livered pacifist? No, you idiot. A lesson in the destructive capability of a Browning automatic rifle at close range. Now, yeah, cut the small talk and step up the pace of the march and I want to be in Munich before Hitler works out that he shits turds just like everybody else. Will our band of plucky Americans accomplish their top secret mission? Will the squad survive Sergeant Grinder's unique approach to discipline? Find out in the next exciting episode of Sergeant Grinder's Suicide Squad.